you can see there are lots of boxes in front of Mayo and few boxes are on the ground so it's very hard to grab uh, if you want to pick this Mayo so I have to pick this one see how clean it is easy to pick easy life one issue I find like I have to pick Diet Coke so you can see it is at the back and you can see how it is stacked how shaky it is so there are lots of chance like it can be fall and if it will fall it will gonna break but anyhow i'll put it one down and one also down so that, that's fine so i fix this but just let me This is something that bugs me. Whenever I come into the toilets, this tap does is always leaking. So somebody doesn't close it. So let's fix that. Here we go. The best thing is to fix the taps, but the second best thing is to leave a sign. So hopefully guys, please read this and respect the water and the resources. Thank you. This is a really bad issue. What and time I is found it? found this about five times like this in the last week. This is, should not be left out like this. This should be put straight back in the chiller. Whoever's doing that is wrapping not on. And that's what time it is. Another thing that bugs me, just from night staff, they will always open up two of the same pallets without using a whole one like that. And same as here, 729 there, 729 there. Use the whole pallet first before you open up another one, please. Hello, so one of the things that were bugging me was a vehicle pre-start inspection. All the drivers had to fill one out every morning and I had to go scan it and save it into the system. We've gone and digitalised one, so the drivers will get a QR code sent to their phone with all the options to fill out instead of doing it on the paper version. They'll then go over to a spreadsheet where it will get pre-filled out, and we've also created a maintenance one which I'll fill out if there's any issues with the trucks. They'll then get filled with a Rishi to make repairs, and I can see whether he's booked repairs and when the truck's getting finished. And we've also got a QR code that will go to each individual driver so they don't have to fill out their own name or their own rego or we pre for them to make their day easier. We're in the midst of fixing this section. Um, we've just got a few crates of just mixed um, lids and cups in that. Um, Daniel's been moving stock and replenishing. Um, we'll have to sort out the rest tomorrow, but we're just giving you guys some space for tonight when you do your pick. Um, um, not 100% fixed yet, we're at 50%, so this is AC oil. Um, as you can see, we're going to start going through these boxes today, there's space here, um, and we'll post that video as soon as we're halfway done. I just want to tell you about AC wall, that was really bug us. So what we're doing now, we just like empty all the boxes, sorting out everything. So we move the stock that we like both most selling stock we make the location at the front and some stock from like the pallet from that we put on the floor we move from from here like DDL32 etc. We are still doing improvements because there's a lot of you here that will take time of course so that's it.